Hello everyone, welcome to my February 2019 haul video. Welcome back everyone to a brand new haul video. This is for February of 2019. If you are not familiar with this series of videos that I do here on my channel, it is essentially what the title suggests. Every single month I go through all the different things that I picked up in that month. This just happens to be February of 2019. And they're usually things that relate to movies or books or comic books, things like that. First up here is the comic book that I keep getting every single month. So please excuse Excuse me if I sound like a broken record now, and this is the issue number 27 of the current run of Supergirl, which is written by Mark Andreco. I thought I picked up some more comic book related items last month, but I can't seem to remember where I put them, so this will have to do. I'm a big fan of Supergirl and DC Comics, as probably many of you know from watching this channel, and I don't pick up many single issue runs. I wait until the trades come out, because that seems to be the more affordable way to collect comics, although it is fun to collect them individually as well. And now transitioning into the movie related items I picked up, first up here is actually something I have not had in my collection since I was a very young child on VHS. I didn't have this on DVD, I didn't have this in the various Blu-ray editions that have come out over the years, and I finally decided to re-add it to the collection, if you will, and that is Disney's The Little Mermaid. This is the anniversary edition, this is the 4K UHD edition, and I'm really glad to finally have it because this is one of the most important Disney films throughout the entire history of Disney animation because this is the film that really kick-started the renaissance of the 1990s. Coincidentally, it came out in 1989, but after this, you started getting the major films that a lot of people are just madly in love with today. Beauty and the Beast, Lion King, Mulan, etc., etc. You know all of them if you grew up at that time. Even if you didn't, these movies are still around today. They're still going to be impacting generations going further and Little Mermaid has always had a special place in my heart because I watched it incessantly as a child. The next up is a film that is also kind of musically related and that is A Star is Born. This film is of course the directorial debut of one Bradley Cooper starring both himself as well as Lady Gaga. I did an individual review for this film when it was released sometime last year, so please check that out if you haven't already. And I, of course, picked it up in the 4K Ultra HD edition. I believe it made my top 15 movies of the year list. Next up, also a movie that is musically related, and this movie is a bit of a controversial film, and that is Bohemian Rhapsody, which was not really directed by Bryan Singer, perhaps by Dexter Fletcher, because Bryan Singer was fired while making this movie, so who really knows who did what, when, and how it was constructed. All I can tell you is that this film made a lot of money at the box office, was very popular amongst the mainstream crowd of moviegoers, but it does have a lot of its problems, which I believe I outlined during the review I did when this movie came out. I just want to say one thing. I cannot believe that this movie won Best Editing at the Academy Awards. I... I'm flabbergasted by that. Next up is, I think, one of the most underrated films of 2018, and that is Blind Spotting. This is a fantastic, amazing film that more people need to watch. It is such a hidden gem, and I really can't tell people enough to watch it. Please, go out, watch it. It's available on Blu-ray, DVD, digital versions on iTunes and Amazon and wherever. Just go watch this movie, please. Next up is a film directed by Spike Lee, who of course directed the most recent film, Black Klansman, which had a lot of critical acclaim last year and was one of my personal favorite films of last year. And this is a film that came out quite a few years ago, and that is School Days. This is the film that came out before Do the Right Thing, which is probably considered his most well-known film, or perhaps his best film, and at least in my opinion. But this is a film I've actually never seen, I've never owned it, so I'm really looking forward to growing the Spike Lee collection. I have quite a few of his films, but I'm really wanting to dig into a lot of his earlier work, because his earlier work I find to be very interesting and very unique, as opposed to more of his 90s and contemporary work. 
The next two things are the final things that I picked up last month, and they're both 4K UHD steelbooks. The first one here is of How to Train Your Dragon, which is the first film in one of my favorite animated franchises of all time. I think that this franchise is so underrated. It is put out by DreamWorks and Universal, and it is really just a gorgeous, beautiful, aesthetic film, as well as having great themes. And of course, I have the second one here, which is just titled How to Train Your Dragon 2. The third film just came out called How to Train Your Dragon, The Hidden World, which I've already done a review for here on this channel, so please check that out as well. And that kind of ended this wonderful franchise. Before I go, I want to give you a look here on the back, because luckily this doesn't have that sticky glue that most of these steelbooks tend to have. Here's for the backing for How to Train Your Dragon, and of course the back for How to Train Your Dragon 2, a wonderful, awesome action shot of Hiccup and Toothless, just really solidifying their forever bond. So that has been my haul video for February of 2019. Not a big haul video. For some reason, I thought I bought a lot more things, but time is just really moving fast this year, so please bear with me when it comes to that. But if you want to see anything else in any more detail, please let me know. I will either discuss it with you in the comments below or do a review for it and a separate video. Once again, if you like this video, please check out the other videos I have on my channel.